Hello everyone, it's uh, Press to Play here once again, and I just got these in the mail today, and I just started doing a video on these uh, amazing albums, and as I was showing you the inside, the digital code fell out and everybody could see it, and as much as, as I love <laughs> to share that with you, I do really want it to myself, so uh, I had to redo it again, so I'm going to start over. These are incredible, incredible albums by Peter Gabriel. Um, just fantastic. It comes with the dark side mixes and the bright side mixes. And I'm going to say that this is one of his best albums. I think it's definitely better than us and on the same par as so. I think it's a fantastic, fantastic album. Um, so on the weekend, while I was waiting for the albums to arrive, I did listen to most of the album on YouTube. And uh, I just loved every single track. So these do come off, um, so I'm gonna, I wanna keep those. This is the blue is the dark side, pink is the bright side. But just to go through some of the tracks with you, um, the opening number, um, Panapakam, hope I said that right. Um, love the arrangement, I love the acoustic guitar in that one, and his voice sounds incredible on every single track. This album is, I'm gonna go so far, I'm gonna say it, I think it's a masterpiece, I really do. Um, I'm really, putting myself out there when I when I say that it's that good but I just love this album I just love every single track um, the arrangements his voice the lyrics everything um, anyways the opening track is is excellent four kinds of horses again very 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 good I love road to joy very upbeat um, sounds very very different to sledgehammer but it has that kind of same fun fun vibe to it it's a really fun song um this is home a beautiful slower ballad beautiful song as well i always a lot of fun uh i think it's a great track it'd be a great single uh so much beautiful as well and still really hit home to me because i recently lost my mother and that song is about peter gabriel losing his mom so it's a it was a very personal track and it really, um, I could really connect with it. And I think I listened to that song a billion times over the weekend. Um, yeah, just, just a really beautiful song about losing your mother and just um, and grieving and, and going through that whole process. But it's a beautiful, beautiful track, beautiful lyrics. The court is incredible. And I love the, um, again, I love his voice on that. But when he sings the court, you have to listen to it to understand it. It's a beautiful track, just a spectacular track. Love Can Heal, and again, I love every track on here. Uh, Olive Tree is more upbeat, and then uh, Live and Let Live. There's not a song I dislike. I, I think it is a brilliant album. I really, in my own opinion, of course, but I, I really do believe it's a masterpiece. It was, it was well-crafted, beautiful, beautiful uh, album. Anyway, very cool visuals here as well. I'll try to be careful not to show you the digital code again. I love this album cover too. I think he's he's got the coolest album covers. I just love this. The visual is amazing. Okay, so let's take a look at the album. It comes with this beautiful, high quality, very nice booklet on really heavy paper. And uh, look at, it's just beautiful. So much like the album Us, I wanted to connect music and art on this record. Visual artists have the same sort of obsessive focus on detail that we have with our musical work. I wanted to see if the songs that might open up a little more with the strong visual piece attached. This might allow the listener and viewer a different way in. I am delighted so many great artists were willing to be part of this project and feel that we have and I feel that we have created something unique together with IO. So check out these really interesting works of art. And it comes with the lyrics and it talks about the, um, the art piece as well. But this is very, very cool. Oh, I thought that was the most interesting photo. That's by Tim Shaw. Really cool photograph. This is called Snap, but I love how he included the lyrics along with a little write-up. Beautiful. It's called the Color Experiment. 
beautiful picture there. A small painting of what I think love looks like. But really cool images. I thought this was very cool as well. Interesting. These are just, just incredible. So if you're thinking, I mean, I ordered the CD set as well because I want the Dolby Atmos version of this, but it's worth picking up the albums just for the booklet. These are beautiful visuals and, and the write-up on the art. So it's it's the way to go. This is, look at that. It's incredible. So definitely, uh, if you're debating whether to pick up the album for the booklet alone, definitely pick it up, 100%. Um, let's take a look at the vinyl. 180 gram, of course. Really cool label there as well. And here's the other side. It's just very cool. And this is the, the dark mix. And I love how they put them in good sleeves so the albums aren't damaged. Let's put these back in here. And it also comes out the other side as well. And they, they go in nicely. And we'll take a quick look at the other album here. The same thing. So I won't bother showing it for the sake of time. So I do want to open up the pink as well to see if there's any differences. It's blue on the inside as well. But uh, beautiful, beautiful presentation here. Really nice presentation. I like it. And again, the uh, this blue piece of paper on the side of Wilt has come off. So I'm going to put these in... Uh, Sorry about that. Protective sleeves. Let's open up the pink as well. And these are fairly easy to open up, which is nice. Okay, I'll take this off. And I'm assuming it's going to be the same, but we'll take a quick look anyway. Again, really cool on the inside. I don't want to show you the <laughs> download code again. Oh no, it's different. Check this out. Oh, this is interesting. So these don't come in the nice, I wonder why that, that's the case. That's interesting. I don't want to show you the download code again. There it is. Yeah, this is different than the other ones. This is, has a, uh, this one's pink. But I'm assuming it's going to be the same. It's just everything's in pink on this one. Oh, no, look, check this out. I don't remember that in the other one, unless I missed it. Maybe I just missed it. That's really cool. Yeah, it's the same images. I must have just missed that one. Take a quick look here. Yeah, it's all the same images as the other booklet. I must have missed that one. Sorry about that. And I think I missed, did I miss that one? I might have. I must have. I think I missed a couple in the other one. Anyway, beautiful booklet. These are just really high quality. Let me show you that one again. I'm, I think I missed that in the other one. Red Gravity, very cool. And the albums, for some reason, they are not. This one's not in the uh, the nice sleeves. That's too bad. Anyways, there's pink. I wonder why that. That's the case. It's really interesting. Why? But no, the, no, no, no. Take that back. I correct myself. These are white. The other ones are black, but they still have that, like they're good quality. So uh, my apologies. I got that wrong. It's just the, the um, presentation is different. That's all. Put this back in. So it does come with the download code for the high quality audio. So if you're, you know, if you want the digital as well as the vinyl, if you get the vinyl, you're going to get the digital as well. You just download it. So that's pretty sweet. And there, again, it's on the pink. It's got the pink outline there. 
So my mistake, sorry about that, it does come with the good high quality uh, inner sleeves there as well. Anyway, what, what a fantastic album from Peter. This is, again, I, I don't know what to say. Highlights for me, I love I.O. I love And Still. That really hit my, tugged at my heartstrings because it reminded me of my own mom. Road to Joy, beautiful, up, upbeat song. I love playing for time. I love the court. Olive Tree was awesome. Very upbeat song. Pena Pecom, the opening track, I hope I said that right, was uh, awesome. I, I love every one. I love every single track. It's, it's a wonderful album. So if you're on the fence on whether to pick this up, definitely 100% pick it up. You will not be disappointed. It is classic, classic Peter Gabriel. Anyway, thanks for hanging out. And uh, if you enjoyed the video and if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to uh, subscribe. And uh, if you do click the bell, you'll be notified when I post new videos and all that stuff. You know the drill. Anyway, take really good care of yourselves. And uh, yeah, enjoy this brilliant new album by Peter Gabriel. I'm just in awe of how good it is. I just think it's a great album. Take good care. I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.